How's it going everyone? Hi, my name is Chad. I'm from Wonder Spark Puppets and today we're going to be making an amazing puppet. A puppet of Goldilocks. Now, who's here uh, heard the story of Goldilocks and three bears? Put your hand way up high, maybe, possibly, everybody. Okay, so there is a moment in the story of Goldilocks and the three bears that we're going to be making today. That's right, we're not just going to be making a Goldilocks puppet. We're going to be making uh, a scene from the story, okay? The very moment when Goldilocks wakes up in Baby Bear's bed. Now, uh, if you remember in the story of Goldilocks and Three Bears, she's asleep in Baby Bear's bed, and then she wakes up to find a bear right in front of her. How do you think she feels? Hmm. How would you feel? if you woke up and there was a bear right next to your bed. So, uh, remember those feelings, keep those feelings in here, okay? Think about those feelings because we're going to be uh, making an expression that means how somebody's feeling, like their face, on the Goldilocks puppet because we're making the moment when Goldilocks wakes up. And it's gonna be extremely simple. Let's get to our materials, okay. So, all we need for this puppet because we're going to be making not just the puppet, but the bed also. We're going to need... We're going to need a regular sheet of paper. Okay. We're going to be using construction paper. Uh, but... And this should be thicker. So, like, um, cardstock, construction paper, that's all good. And this can be whatever color you want. Okay. We're going to need some tape. Any kind of tape. Right. Some scissors. And um, uh, you can use a pen or a popsicle or a chopstick, something to tape to our puppet to turn it into a rod puppet, okay? And of course, I always use uh, a marker for outlining, but you can use whatever you like, and we're gonna get to coloring and stuff in a bit. So, first step is we're going to make the bed. That's right, make your bed. Uh, <laughs> we're just gonna use this construction paper. I chose purple for mine, but yours can be whatever color you like, okay? Once you have uh, it picked out, uh, we're going to make our bed. So, at about right here, at about three quarters through, understand that we're going to be cutting right here, okay? There's gonna be a sheet over here, and let's say pillows up here, so what I'm going to do just to help myself out is I'm just going to draw a little bit of like a dotted line right there to remember this is going to get cut right there. Now, we can make our bed. We can make pillows up here. You know, I'm going to draw some pillows on there because why not? Right, this is going to go underneath Goldilocks's head. We're going to draw some pillows. You could make some pillows if you wish. You could make them out of like paper or whatever, and then tape them up there. You can go as crazy as you like. Uh, and then down here, we're gonna make sure and put, you know, I'm just gonna make like a sheet line so everyone understands like this is a blanket. You could turn this into maybe like a quilt. Uh, you could do colored sheets. Maybe you have some pattern sheets at home with like cartoon characters on it. Whatever you like. <clears throat> when you're done with this step, when you feel like this is a pretty good bed, then we're going to cut, okay? And we're gonna cut, remember, right here, about three quarters, you gotta separate the sheet from the pillows, all right? So I made myself a little dotted line. This does not have to be exactly straight. It's totally fine. All right, once you have this totally separated, we're going to put on four pieces of tape. Okay, we're going to be taping here and here. We'll do that first. And remember, like I said, you can use any kind of tape. And this should be, they should be close together, like as close as they were before. Okay, we want to make sure that this looks like one singular piece of paper again. It's a little bit of an illusion. Okay, we're going to put, so we've got our two pieces of tape right there. We're going to flip it over. Oh, and, and by the way, pause this video at any point because I'm going super fast. But uh, we're going to flip it over. Woo! Put two more pieces of tape. 
on the side. Sometimes it helps to watch a video with an artist who's making something. Like, watch the whole thing first <laughs> so you know what's going to happen. Okay, so if you're at this point, if you've gone post your video, we can do this. So this bed is like one big piece of construction paper or, or a hard paper again. But there's a hole in the middle now. Now, if you can make the hole without cutting the whole thing, more power to you. Okay, but I like the pieces of tape on the side. It reinforces it. And our puppet is going to go right into this hole right there. It's kind of like they're going right underneath the covers. All right, so take your bed. Let's put it aside for now. Let's toss it over there. Let's get our piece of paper. We're going to make our Goldilocks puppet. Remember, your puppet cannot be bigger than the opening right here because it has to fit inside. So make sure that your puppet fits within uh, these dimensions, okay? We're gonna draw Goldilocks. Goldilocks, her one feature is that she has gold hair. So your Goldilocks can be however you like. I'm gonna use a yellow marker. You're gonna make some hair. I'm just gonna start with the hair. We're gonna make it like curly hair. All kinds of curly hair to make our Goldilocks. I'm just doing some big circles. Okay. There we go. That looks pretty good. We need, let's see, Goldilocks needs a head. So I'm just going to draw on the rest of this head. See that? Just made a little smiley face. That's Goldilocks's chin. Okay. And then I'm going to draw on a little bit of a body. You don't need a full body. We just need a little bit of a body. So let's say Goldilocks had like a dress or something, right? And you can take as much time as you want making this part. Notice I did not make the face yet. Don't make the face. We're gonna, that's the last step, okay? So we're gonna draw in a little bit of a dress or something. This could be uh, as complicated or as nice looking as you like. It doesn't mean, you can make it any color. When you have the body done, then we're going to concentrate on the face, okay? Now remember, this puppet is going to be waking up to see a bear right in front of them. And um, it could be either they could say, wow, cool, a bear, and have a very mild expression. Let's talk about expression. So when the expression on your face kind of tells us how you're feeling, right? So if you have a very happy expression, you're smiling, Right? If you were a very sad expression, you were maybe frowning. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So think about what kind of expression Goldilocks will have when she wakes up and realizes there's a bear right there. So uh, I'm going to be, I think maybe Goldilocks would be surprised. So I'm going to try a, su a surprised expression. Surprise is when your eyes are way open. Maybe your mouth is open like, ah, ah, bear, ah. That's what I'm gonna be using, but feel free to do whatever expression you want. So to do wide open eyes, we're going to be drawing two big ovals. Whoa. And then we're gonna put the eyes inside there. Okay. Uh, we'll give her a tiny little nose and then a wide open mouth. Ah! And because why not? We'll, we'll give her a little bit of red inside there, like a tongue or something. Ah! Does that look okay? <laughs> Yours can look totally different. Uh, take your time, make this puppet, okay? But it's not a puppet yet until we can manipulate it, work with it. So, we're going to cut this figure out. Okay, remember, it can't be super big or it's not gonna fit in that bed. So I made sure that it was gonna be the, about like this big, okay? Like maybe about the size of your hand. So we're gonna cut this puppet out. This can be, this doesn't have to be a super tight cut, okay? Notice I'm, give, I'm leaving some room on the sides, okay? Don't worry about being, ooh, don't worry about being perfect. Okay, perfection is a goal 
Uh, maybe not something that's ever going to be achieved. Look at this. Look at this pipette. Ah! Kind of yelling like that. Like, oh no! I'm here! Ah! <laughs> um, so, we're going to take this puppet, once it's all cut out, okay, this figure, we're going to flip it onto its face. Whoa, boom! Okay, we're looking at the back. Now we're going to take our, either a pen, a pencil, a chopstick, a popsicle, something long that we can use to turn this into a rod puppet, okay? We're gonna take our long thing, whatever that is, and put it, boop, right here on the puppet, okay? Not like way down here, nope, about like halfway through, right there, like right in the middle, even like a little further, so it's like in the center of mass. Now we're gonna take our piece of tape, whatever you got, masking tape, scotch tape, doesn't matter. We're going to secure our long thing, popsicle stick, totally works, to the puppets, and we wanna make sure to use a couple different pieces so that we can have some good movement, okay? If you can pick up the puppets, and wiggle it around. Can you do that? <laughs> ah! <laughs> if you can wiggle it around and it's secure without flying off, you did a good job. All right, take your time with this also. Once you have this part, oh, we're gonna have some fun now. So we have the bed, remember, with the hole inside. We have our puppets with its expression, whatever that is. We're going to take the puppets and put it inside of the bed. Whoop. So you guessed it. We can see a little head at the top poking out. Now we can snore with it. Ready? We're going to do a snore. And then, remember, we're going to wake up. There's a bear right in front of you. Goldilocks, wake up. There's a bear. Look out. I want to go back to sleep. No, 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 there's a bear. Look out. There's a bear? Yes. How do you feel? What's your expression? Ah! <laughs> oh, I think Goldilocks is hiding under the covers now. Ooh, I'm so scared. Ah! <laughs> ah! And, and my, my puppet is totally catching on this bed, so I think the more we work with it, the easier it will be. But it's okay if it... I think my, my pencil is catching on the back. Ah! Okay, and that's it. That's our Goldilocks waking up puppets. I hope you guys had a good time. Look, I can even do it this way. Ah! <laughs> uh, make whatever expression you like. Maybe Goldilocks pops out and she's like, I, I love bears, this is great. And she has a big smile on her face. It's up to you, okay? Once again, my name is Chad from Wonder Spark Puppets. Take your time. I know you can do it. You got this. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.